What's up guys, this is FC Glitchin here and in today's video we're going to be talking about Call of Duty Black Ops 3 multiplayer. I've got some new information regarding the prestiges and all that kind of stuff for you guys. It's kind of a comment from David Vonderhaar and it is confirmed obviously because it's coming from him. In case you were wondering, there's going to be a total of 10 prestiges as well as 55 levels per prestige uh, in the Call of Duty Black Ops 3 multiplayer game. Uh, that was about a month ago that that was announced. But here is his statement. We are not fans of adding prestige levels after launch. We wanted prestige to have an end goal and off ramp. It's why we gave it a name, Master Prestige, and remove the level icon when you hit it. We do think that there is room to do interesting things to highlight a Master Prestige player that keeps playing that is not adding more prestige levels. It's designed but not implemented yet, and I don't want to put my foot in my mouth in case it doesn't happen for scope or schedule reasons. Now this is in contrast to Sledgehammer games, when they launched Call of Duty Advanced Warfare with 15 prestiges, uh, and then in March they added another 15 prestiges called Grand Master Prestiges. And with Infinity Ward for their older release, Modern Warfare 3, they added 10 prestiges after that title's launch. Uh, so, I'm kind of glad myself that they're not going to be adding more prestiges because I don't really use the prestige system that, that much myself, honestly. I usually get up maybe one prestige, two prestiges, and then just stay at max level because I don't like having to regain everything. I just like staying there. And uh, leveling up isn't really my thing, I guess. Some people do really, really like it and try to get like master prestige within the first couple days of a game being out. Uh, but it's kind of up to like your playing style and everything like that. Uh, I do think that it's good that they're not adding this because they do kind of just add these prestiges just to lengthen the game's lifespan. Uh, because, you know, Advanced Warfare was dying, then they're like, oh, maybe we should put in some uh, new Grandmaster prestiges uh, just to lengthen the lifespan a little bit, get a couple more people playing. But I am really excited to see what Vonderhaar was talking about uh, when they said they were going to add in something that might spice things up for those Master Prestige players that want to keep on playing and can't add any more prestige levels. Uh, so I think that's going to be a cool implementation if they do go ahead and implement it, uh, because they did say that they can't guarantee it yet. Uh, but I hope that we do see that. I hope that uh, you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, I would really appreciate it if you guys could leave a like in the video. Also, comment down below, tell me what you think about the prestige system and everything else in this video, and make sure to check out my second channel, Trend Crave. I'll leave a link down in the description. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I'm Ossie Glitching, and I'm out.